In this video I'll be taking a look at a cool little utility called Discmax. You can get it for free at this website. It's a free download, 892KB, works with all Windows operating systems, uh, works on 32-bit and 64-bit. So let's have a little look at the uh, program in action. So I've installed it, I've got it downloaded already to my desktop, I'm just going to quickly install this. say yes to that and accept. It's as simple as that really. Okay so we've got this little option screen here and all we need to do is select what we want to do. Obviously quick is going to be a real quick one. Let's, let's do a complete one and see what's what. It wants to check for updates so I'm going to say yes. Let it do its thing. Let's just shut that box down. Okay, so we've got this little uh, pop-up box here, and it's going to go through the motions and ask us whether we want to delete stuff out of the recycle bin or not. So I'm going to say uh, yes to that. Yes to that. Browsing history. Quite a useful little program. There's a lot of these on the market for free to download like sea cleaner and stuff like that but I really do like the look of this uh, program so I'm just going to say no to this one yes to that and this one windows update this will just uh, Get rid of all those event logs. So it does quite a few little tools. It's got a little optimization tool on it as well. That optimization uh, it optimizes the um, prefetch folder. I don't I don't know what it does, um, but it does a, uh, some optimization there. I'll let this uh, finish off. OK, it wants to do a deep scan, deep scan now, and uh, I'm going to say yes to that. As you can see, a little uh, bar going across the bottom there. Let's do it on the uh, recycle bin now. I think the reason why that kept coming up is because I kept taking the tick out so it's best to leave the tick in I'm just doing it for this video but leave the remember my answer and you won't get that nag box anymore okay defragmentation I'm not gonna bother with that but you can do if you want to um, but I'm just gonna take the tick out for this one and just say no because for the time element really now prefetch optimizations I don't know what it does. Click state in order in which allocations request files. So it's obviously going to do some sort of optimization of the uh, prefetch folder there. So I'm just going to say no in this case because it will probably take a bit of time. But obviously, I would say yes normally. Okay, and it's going to do something now. I don't know what it's doing now. It's just finishing off, I think. Anyway, I think that's pretty much it for this video. I'm going to quit this out now. Uh, so, if you ever want any more information, you can actually go to his website. He has got quite a little, of, quite a lot of information on here that talk, talks all about uh, what it does and what it doesn't do. Gives you a feature list that actually tells you uh, what some of the jobs do: defragmentation, uh, deep scans of a hard disk, uh, removes a lot of these type of file types. Um, removes registry entries okay so it does quite a few uh, tasks there I think you agree it's quite a good little tool to have it's free to download give it a go if you don't like it you can always uninstall it but hey I think it's not too bad for a free program 
Anyway, my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. I hope you enjoy these videos. If you do, please remember to show your support, hit that subscribe button. And also, if you want to join the community, get yourself over to our forum, www.brightechcomputers.co.uk forward slash forum, and uh, get yourself over there, post some uh, tutorials, help out, and uh, I'll see you again soon. Thanks very much for watching, guys. Bye for now.